I'll try and dispatch this guy as quickly as I can. Okay, Dave. Stay close. Wait for him to make a mistake. And as humanely as possible. Like that. Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Finally, we've done an online race on R Factor 2. I've been waiting for this moment for literally years. And that's thanks to Low Fuel Motorsports. Now, Low Fuel Motorsports have been paving the way for ACC players to race competitively online and have a system similar to iRacing. Well, they've brought the service to R Factor 2. Now, this is still in beta. So it's probably not the finished article, but I can tell you from my experience for this race, it was flawless. So this one is a 30 minute British touring car race around Brands Hatch. And we've chosen to drive the rear wheel drive Infinity. Now there were only 10 people signed up for this race. It was 3 p.m. yesterday, but it turns out it was an absolutely cracking race. And we haven't qualified. We're starting right at the back. Now, I don't really know anything at all about R Factor 2, so it's going to be a very steep learning curve, as you'll probably guess by this video. But before we get into it, if you do like it at any point, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please consider subscribing. So, 30 minutes around Brands Hatch in the Infinity starting dead last. Let's get on track. We're going to go here. Oh, there we go. Green, green, green. Right. Copy that. No tyres at the next stop. On your right. Still there. Still there. Clear right. That all happened a bit suddenly, for my liking. Anyway. Well done, Dave. Good start. I'm going away here. Just gonna have to be patient. I'm going to shuffle and clear what's going on. I need some R Factor 2 lessons. P6. I think we can get this guy though. Same Jim, shut up. Right, I didn't use my push to pass. Does that work? Come on, David boy. Just 
sixth place. Good night. But the mistake we were looking for. He's still there. Gives a little bit of room to shine. He's still there. He's still there. He's still there. Hold your line. Hold your line. He's still there. Yellow flag sector two. Oh! I didn't know if he was going to send it. Right, come on, Dave. Left side. He's still there. How much room does he want? He's still there. Clear left. What? Terrible. Car left, clear left. Car left. Hold your line. Clear left. There you go, son. Take that. To be a little bit more aggressive there. We'll drop him like a stone now. Good little battle, that though. I enjoyed it. Although I didn't enjoy turn one. Right, P4. Can we get P4? P5. They sound incredible, these things, though. See it right front locking into Druids. No. I don't understand the whole push to pass thing either. I don't know if we've got any. Does it work? Does it not work? I've no idea. That's it. I reckon P4 could be on, you know. That guy's well and truly gone behind now. Sector 2 is 0.6 off the pace. Gaida behind his pitting. Car left. Hold your line. Clear left. Well done, mate. That was great. Get around. These guys aren't a million miles away at all for a podium. 3.8 seconds. If they start battling, you never know. Loads of time left. Gonna start banging in some decent laps. You're pulling away from the guy behind. The gap's now 0.9. Your right front has got 0.9. 
line away. That doesn't board well. We're only 10 minutes in. That's maybe why they went on the mediums. Three seconds now. Guider is now on mediums. Our last lap was a twenty nine six, which isn't too bad. Close this gap though. Has just retired. Oh, look at these two. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Go on, boys. Bad enough. What's that mean? Warning points. 0.75 out of 5. I presume when you get to five, then you get some kind of penalty. The gap in front is now 2.3 seconds. This is incredible, you know. Nearly under two seconds now, the gap. It is under two seconds. Podium could be on. a little bit there. Right on them now, though.
Come on, Div. Don't want that guy in P2 to get away, really. I'll try and dispatch this guy as quickly as I can. Okay, Dave. Stay close. Wait for him to make a mistake. And as humanely as possible. Like that. Feel the tight word as well. Jeez. You're looking your right front into clear ways. I don't know if they're gonna last. You're looking really good. Come on, keep your focus. P3. Feel some more vibrations through the wheel now. Which I've never felt before in a simulator really during a race. Obviously simulating some kind of flat spots. Guys, maybe just gonna run away with it here. Use all the track, force him to find the gap. Flat spot for that guy. Big lock up there. Oh, I'm getting warm. Oh, there's not much grip there now. Oh. Oh, it's gone wide again. Oh, look after your ties, Dave. I don't even know what my push to pass button is. If it does anything. That guy ahead must be a bus, uh, back marker, I think. This is definitely dropped off a bit now. We were gaining, Jim. Oh, shit. Yeah. You definitely feel the tyres have dropped off. Really struggling. But I like it. I like that vibration. Uh oh. I 
I didn't really want to go for that. Still there. Gonna fight now, though. Me too. Ten minutes to go. That's ten minutes left. Curbs feel really good as well. They are factor two. I know that's a weird thing to say, but they do. I hope we don't get a puncture or anything. I really hope we don't get a puncture. They're not done yet though, behind. But I start making mistakes if my tyres just vanish off the face of the earth. Then I'm in big trouble here. Yeah, the tyres have definitely dropped off. There's nowhere near as much grip. The fronts went before the rears. The rears are starting to go a little bit now. Just being a little bit more tail happy. Guy in P1 has just checked out. Curb dragged me off the, the track there. I don't like curbs when they do that. They're like to Michi Hoyer ahead of the game. He's been playing R Factor 2 for so long, as have a lot of people. But I could never see the appeal until you race it online. Different then. Come on, tyres. Okay, Hold up. Can we check the tyres out? 
Yeah. Oh, yeah. You've got 10 minutes of fuel remaining. I don't know what all that means, all the colours. You're locking your right front into Druids. Yellow, red, does red mean the way is really bad? I presume so. Drop those guys off behind, thankfully now. Seeing minor wear on your rear tyres. We see insignificant wear on the fronts. Yeah, I know. I know, Jim. I know, Jim. I'm going to bring it home now, though. Don't do anything stupid, Dave. One thing I have noticed, though, the sensation of speed isn't that great. I'm guessing it's not very good for you guys, just sit looking at the centre monitor. But for me, it's better because I've got triples. But uh, when all the numbers are put in correctly for the triples, it just doesn't look as good. Oh, it wouldn't turn then. have had any pace for the guy in front, the guy in P1. So I think if we'd have qualified and started P2, we probably would have finished where we are right now, I think. So much better than the touring cars on iRacing though. So much better. Like, a oh, million times better. Handling and sound wise. Just hands down better. Just two minutes left, two minutes. There's my wipers. There we go. Does it clean the window? No. I do with a spray. Should have gone with the mediums, I think. I know for next time, though. It's all learning on our factor two. I don't know anything about it, literally. So if anybody wants to part their wisdom, please do so in the comments below. I really don't know anything about okay, it. Dave, one more to go. Keep it together. We'll be on the podium. One more lap.
We'll have to have a look at that turn one incident again. I've, I can't understand why, you know, he, he pinched me onto the right hand side. I can't imagine, I don't know why he then didn't pinch me in and then move over to the normal racing line onto the left. You know, to get a good exit to uh, overtake me coming out of the turn. He just kind of kept it really tight for some reason. But first online race on our Factor 2. And we do a last to P2. Yeah, I know there's only 10 people in it. But P2, we had to work for it as well. How much fuel's left? Loads. Great drive. That's a podium. Yeah, it is, Jim. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is, Jim. We'll take that gang, won't we? We will take that. Excellent. Ooh, just slowing down, just savouring the track now. Just checking it out. You may be wondering why I've got this wheel rim on. Because I'm testing another wheel. And I can't let you guys see it yet. And it shows off too much of it. On the camera, so... I thought, better air on the side of caution. I'm not sure, because I'll never get sent anything ever again. I'm pleased it didn't rain. Oh, it's a helicopter, hello. Top job. So let's check out the results. So there were only 10 of us in this race. We finished P2. And we gained 51 on our ELO and 0.29 on our safety rating. Just one incident point. Fastest lap at 29.6. So not a million miles away from the race winner, but nearly 12 seconds back. But even though we finished P2, we weren't the biggest winner. Stefan was the biggest winner with 52. And biggest loser, well, not really anybody. Um, Got to be burned. He's the only one with an ELO that lost. He lost 21. So there we go. After all that, we managed to get P2 again on our ELO and again on our safety rating. It seemed to take forever to get past that guy. But once we did, we were able to move forward. But I still don't think we would have had the pace to get the race win. So P2, I'm happy with that. As far as getting into the race server goes, absolutely a piece of cake. Really, really simple. Like, so much easier than I thought it was going to be. And the server ran flawlessly. Absolutely perfect. So if you like R Factor 2, well, you're going to have to sign up to LFM because it's going to have ranked daily races. Absolutely perfect. R Factor 2 drove incredibly well. I was a bit surprised at the flat spot on the tyres, the vibration. I presume that's what it was. Um, but I felt that throughout the second part of the race, really. So you've got to be really careful with your tyres, which is brilliant. So remember, if you did like the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, please consider subscribing. Let me know in the comments if you've been on R Factor 2 on LFM. And has your experience been as perfect as mine? Let me know. As always, thanks for watching. Have a great week. See you later. Cheers.